I mean, it never fails. Here we go again, y'all. Look, look. <laughs> I'm trying to get ready. He's like, excuse me. I said I want rubs. I want cuddle time. <laughs> Hell no. Okay, you guys, welcome back to the video. Okay, welcome back to the channel. If you all are new, go ahead, uh, subscribe, and turn the notification bell on. We're just going to get that out of the way right now. Yes, we got music playing in the background again, okay? Um, yeah, so as you all already know from the title, this is going to be talking about why do people stare at you? Mm, yeah, that's a very good question. Why do people, why are they, I, I, I definitely ask that question a lot. Okay, so um, this should be juicy. This should be interesting. This should be divine. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead um, and tap this. Cleanse the energy real quick. Okay, go on ahead and cleanse the energy. Cleanse it, baby. Cleanse it, baby. Ooh, 111 was just on the timer. 111 was just on the timer. Okay. Yes. All right, let me go ahead and set this down. Alrighty. So, we're gonna do the collective reading real quick, and then we're gonna get into the separate pals and all of those teens, okay? So, let's go ahead and see. What I'm gonna get right now is like the, basically the overall like message or energy, okay? Or, you know, like the overall reason why people stare at you, right? Why why people are staring at you. I'm going to get one card from each one of these decks, talk about it intuitively, and then, okay, we are going to go ahead and uh, get into the separate pals, okay? So we have one card here. That shit is so crazy. Oh, this card was meant to come out. Because before I even started the video, I shuffled these cards just to see, you know, if, you know, just to get a feel for them and see, like, if these cards is, like, matching with the vibe of the reading or whatnot. And this card came out. And then I was like, okay, I was like, okay, I read it intuitively. Woo -woo. Okay, cool. But it, ca it came back out, y'all. It came the fuck back out. I keep getting the, the camera on the phone. It's over here. It's not over here. I switched it up today. Um, yeah. This card came back out. Um, this is from the Goddess deck, I believe. Um, yeah, Goddess Power deck. Uh, this Goddess here is... Um, I'm not even going to try to pronounce that. Because I'm going to slaughter it. So, so, I'm not doing it. But, you know, she is the Goddess of Mastery, okay? We, let me, we're going to talk about it in a minute. Okay? Did I just... Shuffle from this deck? Yes, I did. Um, and then we have down here at the bottom of the deck, uh, Rhea, I believe. Wow. This is interesting. Okay, so Rhea, the number for Rhea is 45. The number for this goddess here is, I mean, 44. Shit. And then the number for this goddess is 45. That's very interesting. Uh, you can look up those, uh, angel numbers as well, too. Um... Before I talk about it, we're gonna shuffle this deck real quick, okay? We are going to go ahead and shuffle this deck, get this out the way. Come on, get up there now, okay? Um, let's see why is it that people stare at um my collective? Okay, we got a card here. Ooh, we got the cosmic heart. Okay, down here it says devotion, potency. Make your life a moving prayer, okay? We're going we gonna to set that right here, okay? I don't know how I want to do this. How I want to do this, okay. Um, At the bottom of the deck, we got, you got the love. Okay, you you got the love. Um, It also says, uh, what does that say? Hotterian energy. I don't know. I guess that's like a star seed family or cosmic family or whatnot. But uh, Hotterian energy. I'm going to have to go look that up. Codependency and boundaries. Okay. All right. So let's go ahead and um, get into this. 
Okay, so, um, right here, right? In this card, I can see already that a lot of people stare at you because you, one, because of your glow, as you can see all around her, right? There's like this energy, there's like this glow or whatnot. And you can even see it on the card. Like, if I turn it a certain way, you'll be able to see it. But, you know, if I face it straight towards y'all, it's kind of a glow because the window open over here. But, um, yeah, yeah, first of all, y'all do have a glow, right? Y'all definitely have a glow um, about you. It's just the energy that you all have and the energy that you all exude, right? Um, it, 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 it's captivating, right? It's magnetic. It is uh, sweet to the eyes for some reason. Um, I get also that you all may activate people's third eyes just um, because as you can see, she got the little uh, dot right there representing the third eye. You all activate people's third eye just with your presence, which is very fucking interesting. Everybody here, y'all are some bad motherfuckers. Um, interesting. Also, her fingertips, right? Her fingertips are like a different color. They're like red. I get that a lot of people stare at you all as well because they, um, they just want to, they just want to touch you. You know what I'm saying? You all could be very, 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 very good looking. Um, if not, you could be just good looking. If not, you know what I'm saying? To these people, you look good, right? Everybody look good in their own way. Just, you know, just let me put that out there. Let me just say that, okay? Um, But yeah, we got mastery down here. I'm seeing that Um, what I'm getting is that a lot of people also stare at you because you all learn. You all um, are like quick learners. Y'all y'all learn things. I don't know if y'all ever um, been like at work or at school or like just out doing something, right? And you just look up and you see like uh, one or two people just staring at you. You know what I'm saying? Or whatnot. Or you could be at the gym or whatnot and look up and people staring at you. It's because it's like people is kind of amazed by how y'all do shit. Like the way that y'all do shit is, it's like, it's like, it's like you are in the flow state. That's funny because we got, <laughs> we got flow right here, right? It's like you all are in the flow state. It's like you all are um, unfazed by things that even may seem challenging too. You know what I'm saying? So a lot of people is like, God damn, this, this, this motherfucker here, this motherfucker here, right? So definitely y'all energy is booming. Y'all, y'all have this very poised energy as well too, I can say. Um, a lot of people may be staring at you because of your hair too. I don't know, uh, you all may have, dyed y'all hair, colored it, or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah. A lot of people stare at you possibly because of your hair as well, okay? Um, and yet again, she got, um, like, paint over her eyes. Also, a lot of people stare at you because of your eyes, right? They want to see your eyes. Even here in this card at the bottom right here, look at her eyes. Like, come on now. Look at her eyes. You see? Um, very captivating. You all have very, very magnetic type of energy, okay? Um, a lot of people also stare at you because, um, yet again, the energy that exudes from you is very powerful. It, 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 it catches people off guard. You, you all are the type of people where you walk in a room and you turn heads. <laughs> you walk in a room and people's like, hmm, okay. Like, you walk in the room, people start sitting up, people start playing with their hair, fixing shit. Like, um, they're like, oh, hold on, this motherfucker walked in. Let me get right. Let me get myself together. Okay, let's get correct. Okay, um, and then with this, you got the love, right? Um, I'm hearing that they, I'm seeing also that there's a lot of people that stare at you all. Okay, there is a lot of people. Like, you all may get, look up and see, like, just strangers staring at y'all, too. You know what I'm saying? Walking down the street, looking up, people just looking at you, staring at you. You know what I'm saying? You go to somewhere new or, you know, somewhere where you, you know, never really 
hang out at or never really go to. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you're not a Starbucks person, go to Starbucks. People looking at you. You know what I'm saying? Um, a lot of people stare at you. You have a lot of people staring at you, right? You guys definitely... Um, it's y'all energy. It's definitely y'all energy. And all four of these cards, it's definitely energy that's being brought up. Um, ex you know, because there's like this light, this energy that's exuding from people, right? A lot of people stare at you too because they are confused. I don't know why Spirit brought it up just like that, but they um, stare at you a lot because of the, uh, you know, the confusion, as you can see here depicted in the picture. There's a lot of different people here. There's a lot of different confusion. Also, a lot of people may uh, stare at you all because they feel like they know you, right? Um, some of y'all don't even know. That may be... Um, some of these people may feel like um, you are like like y'all met in a past lifetime or something. Or like y'all so... Um, it's like their soul kind of recognizes yours, Right? For some reason, we shall see it when we get into the readings. Um, yeah, you all radiate. Okay, y'all radiate. And um, a lot of people stare at y'all because y'all be in y'all own little world. And um, as you, because as you can see here, even in this card, yeah, even in this card too, right? Everybody is focused on their own little thing going on up in here, okay? Y'all be focused on y'all shit. Like, whatever it is that y'all uh, be doing, y'all be focused on it. Like, y'all... And y'all tap into, like, a flow state. I'm sorry. Y'all tap into, like, a flow state. Uh, flow state. Yeah, y'all are very devoted to whatever it is that y'all put y'all mind to. And a lot of people stare at y'all because of y'all determination. This determination energy, okay? Um, yes. Okay, guys, welcome to the selection, okay? So, we have three groups as usual. Group one, group two, group three. Now, group one has this charm here, okay? This, um, I believe this is Saturn. Saturn had the rings, right? So, yeah, this rainbow Saturn here. Um, yeah, we have this little rainbow Saturn charm here, okay? Um, paired with, uh, this lover's card here, okay? Paired with this lover's card. Group two has the um, tree charm here that we have seen before in a previous or a couple of readings that I've done before already. Look at the shimmer. We love the glistening and the fucking light. Okay, paired with this justice card. Okay. And lastly, we have the third group here with this rose charm, okay? Paired with the chariot. Okay, so you guys, here we go. Okay, um, now, um, hopefully you all kind of meditate on which power you all wanted. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and get it to power one. The description, um, the time steps will be in the uh, description box below. Okay, so uh, yeah, go ahead and pick your pals. If you feel like you have more than one pal, go ahead. Well, if you feel like, you know, one and more, one, more than one, Jesus, <laughs> more than one pal is calling to you, you go ahead, okay, and you uh, pick your other pal as well, okay? But with that being said, see you and you all's pals. Hello, pal number, group number one. If you all chose this charm here, um, or this card, then this is you all's reading. So let's go ahead and jump right into why um, why do people stare at you, okay? So first of all, you all have very, very, you all are very colorful, okay? 
um, you all's energy is very colorful, meaning, okay, that you all have a lot of depth to you, a lot of life, a lot of energy, right? Um, that's just waiting to be explored. A lot of people look at you and, um, see that you have depth within you. A lot of people can see that you all are hurt, holding back, um, information or holding back with certain things, you know what I'm saying? Keeping certain things mysteries, okay? Um, you don't give all of the details out, right? I mean, because where's the fun in that? Where's the, where is the fun in that, okay? Also, with this being Saturn, um, a lot of people stare at you because of your body. The way it's structured um, may be um, very appealing to a lot of people, okay? Or a lot of people may stare at you um, for the simple fact of your skin, you know, because Saturn kind of rules the skin and rules structure systems, right? So your skin may look nice, right? Even your hair to a certain extent, like we brought up earlier, right? So yeah, um, power one, let's see what else. Um, so the main reason um, why people stare at you all, okay, is because they want to be with you. <laughs> Right? With the lovers here, right? I mean, let's just get straight to it. Let's just get straight to it. Um, You all have a lot of depth, a lot of energy, a lot going on with you. You know what I'm saying? You all are dibbling and dabbling in a lot of different things and um, living your best life. You know what I'm saying? The way that um, life looks to people, right? Um, From the outside looking in, the way that your life looks to people from the outside looking in is pretty... um. It's pretty colorful. It's pretty happy. It's pretty, uh, shit. It's pretty, it's just pretty happy. I mean, like, even look here on this picture. It just looks blissful. <laughs> it just looks blissful. So a lot of people stare at you because they want a piece of whatever it is that you're doing, right? They want to know what it is that you're doing that's making your life look so blissful. Even, and I, that's funny, I brought up the skin because as you can see here, she has, you know, um, some marks here obviously because you know in the, in the show she's a titan this is jesus i forgot that girl name how did i forget that girl name okay anyways she is a uh, titan okay in the show attack on titans okay but um yeah you know what i'm saying a lot of people also stare at you because they seen um the other side of you, right? Uh, what I'm getting is that a lot of y'all are very nice, very sweet. You know what I'm saying? Y'all cool, calm, and collected. You know what I'm saying? Y'all ain't really worried about too much stuff, right? You don't really, you know, out of all the stuff that you may dibble and dabble in, what you don't dibble and dabble in is the drama. No, you can't. You, you don't do that one. Uh, we don't do that shit here. Okay, um, you are... You all do not play with you all's peace. A lot of people stare at you all because they have seen, they have possibly seen you um, defend your peace, right? Stand up for yourself and uh, really let some people have it, right? Really cut some people, you know what I'm saying? Um, because they was overstepping boundaries, right? The lovers also talk about self-value, self-boundaries, uh, you know what I'm saying? And boundaries with others and all those sorts of things. Things, okay, so that's just a little bit about you know the main reason why people, you know what I'm saying, stare at you. Yeah, definitely a lot of people um enjoy looking at you. They just they just see the bliss like that flow, right? Um, uh, for you all, it just seems like things kind of come effortless, uh, you kind of do things effortlessly with a divine flow and glow about yourself, right? As you can see, like the little uh, angelic ring around her head, usually, you know, you see like paintings of Jesus with this little ring around his head or whatnot. But as you can see, divine energy. A lot of people can't really put their finger on why they are so attracted to you, right? But they, but they are. So that's uh, pretty much the main reason. That's like the main reason overall energy of why people are staring at y'all. Okay. Uh, wait a minute. Hold on. How am I doing this again? Right. Okay. <laughs> I almost just tweaked. I almost forgot. Okay. So we got the three of uh, wands here. Okay. Three of wands. 
All right, let's see what else. I'm gonna get two more cards too. Um, yeah, definitely. Damn, that's three. Uh, definitely with the three of wands here. A lot of people. Um, a lot of people. Okay, they. Uh, they stare at you because they 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 see that you have a lot of options. They see that you all have a lot of options. Excuse me. They. They can see that, like as you as you standing here, this is everybody else that's racing towards you. They're like, "Oh my god!" Right? <laughs> hey, look at this! Look at this beauty here. Okay, look at this handsome motherfucker. Look at this goddamn gorgeous woman here. Okay, um, these are some. You all are some fine people, and um, a lot of people. And the only and, and it's not just your physical appearance that's fine. It's your aura. It's your energy. It's the way that you carry yourself, the way that you handle yourself, the way that you handle other people with a gentleness, right? You all are very in tune with your body as well. Um, look how she's holding her uh, her belly area, right? Her abs or abdomen. You know what I'm saying? Her stomach, right? You all are very in tune with your body as well. I'm hearing that some of y'all could be some dancers. Some of y'all um, could be some dancers. You know what I'm saying? Work out a lot all those sorts of things, maybe even into sports and doing makeup and all that stuff. It's just random stuff coming through. You know what I'm saying? These readings is for everybody. Um, yeah, three of wands. A lot of people um, stare at you because they see all the options that you have. But for some reason, it seems like you all may not be choosing right now. <laughs> may not be choosing right now. Um, a lot of people um, can see um, people stare at you because they can see the competition also, right? Um, between, you know, other people that's racing to try to, you know what I'm saying? Get with you all. Okay. Here's the two cards I needed. Um, however, you know what I'm saying? You all, you all, as you can see here, right? As you can see here, you all aren't really focused on all that. You see how you're looking away? Y'all not really focused on all that. Even though in this card, you are kind of looking that way. Like, y'all see it. Y'all see the competition. Y'all also see um, uh, y'all blessings coming in as well with them ships coming in. Like, all you just waiting for your ships to come in. A lot of people stare at y'all because they feel like you all got some major blessings coming in y'all life. So, let's see what these cards is. Oh, wow. King of Pentacles. Look at it. We got the king of pentacles here. <laughs> okay. And then also we have, look, two of cups. I just, I just said it. Like this is more confirmation that people stare at you because they want to be with you. They wondering uh, if you, you know, are with somebody or whatnot. You know, a lot of people are really trying to, and then look here with the king of cups. A lot of people, I mean, king of pentacles, look at how he holding out his pentacle. He like, he's offering this pentacle. <laughs> he's offering this pentacle. Some um, some of you all here may also be dealing with like Tauruses or whatnot. Or some of you all may be even Tauruses, you know? Um, some of you all could be Geminis as well with the lovers here. Um, and all of those sorts of things. Um, if not, this is still going to resonate, right? Um, a lot of people want to give you their pinnacle. A lot of people, you may, yeah, even with these, with this uh, three of wands, a lot of people may be rushing to you or may rush to you and give you things. You know, you may just receive like gifts from random people or, well, damn, that's kind of, that's kind of a long shot, but I just heard that. So some of y'all may receive gifts from random people or compliments. There we go. Like compliments and all those things. But this, the pinnacles represents physical tangible right so you may receive gifts from people um a lot of people may want to give you certain things you know offer you certain things or whatnot and um because they like you they want to be with you like they like your energy they're like yo study go check it out <laughs> okay come check me out here listen look look at me please look at me <laughs> fuck on me let me stop playing um rest in peace Triple X, okay? We miss him. I love that man, okay? Um, what we got here? Oh, we got the hermit. Yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, how she's alone here. Usually in the lovers, there's two people, but she's alone in here. That makes sense. Like I said, y'all not really trying to choose. You know what I'm saying? Or at least that's how it, um, that's the energy that y'all give off. Y'all not choosing right now. But a lot of people, it's like, yo, I wish you was. And I wish you would look at me. <laughs> like, for real. I wish you would look at me. Um, definitely, some of you all may be, you know, going through some things right now. Or you all may be just dealing with some other stuff. Just handling some other things. Getting y'all life in order. Right? Um, and a lot of people is just like, you know, definitely we got popular loners up in here. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people coming up to you. Because even in this card, this person's alone. Even in this King of Pentacles, this person alone. Right here, you alone, right? Yeah. Y'all just in your own world right now. Um, and a lot of people is like, damn. Notice me, right? Do you notice me? Come on now, P and B Rock. Um, also, uh, uh, what what's that man name? What's that boy name? What is that young man name? Jeez Louise, boy, what is your name? The one that, uh, he also made a, uh, a, a song, Do You Notice Me, or whatever. Um, and he also made Blueberry Fago. I forgot this boy name. Damn. How did I forget that boy name? Anyways, um, yeah, I forgot his name. I'm gonna stop thinking. I'm trying. We got the hummingbird here. This is the type of energy that you all give off. Okay, we got the number six here. Connected to the lovers. <laughs> Yeah, y'all are some, y'all are some, and I'm getting also, like I said, y'all are very sweet. Um, Y'all could be very romantic and like flirtatious as well, Um, which is not helping. Um, These other people that's in competition to try to get with you, right? It's not helping them, Uh, like, ease their, uh, what is, the, what is it called? It's not helping them, like, calm down. It's just... Um, fueling the fire. But let's go ahead and read, okay? Um, the hummingbird is an air elemental spirit animal that is all about lightness, freedom. Um, what is up with all these spirit animals that's representing freedom that's coming through in these readings? Okay, I like it though. Um, the hummingbird represents lightness, freedom, enjoyment, <laughs> enjoyment, right? Uh, life, movement, love. Okay, come on now. Skill. Happiness, maneuvering, and journey, okay? The wisdom token from the hummingbird unto you all today is that in, it's to enjoy life. Hello? Enjoy life, okay, more, and release negativity. Release negativity wherever, okay? It is present, okay? Go on big and exciting adventures. Love like you never loved before and be uh, completely immersed in new experiences. Look up and move forward, okay? That was a very beautiful message. The hummingbird, that was a very beautiful message to you. Um, yeah, y'all could be very inspiring to other people too. A lot of people may aspire to get to the level of bliss and just like, what is that called? There's another word too. Um, but I'm gonna use bliss for right now. Um, bliss and flow, right? Bliss and flow that you all are at. Like we said, mastery. You all have mastered how to not be bothered by shit, right? You all have mastered how to tap into your own energy with this hermit here. You all have mastered how to live a life of simplicity, okay? Now, we got an air elemental card right here. Communication, right? Like I said, uh, a little flirting energy here. Um, the way that you speak to people, your words are sweet like roses, right? They sweet like honey. Um, why did I say roses? I don't know. These kind of look like roses, but they're not roses. Um, they don't look like roses. No. Um, but they do when I first looked at them, at least the red ones. But yeah, sweet like honey. Your words are sweet like honey. Um, your heart is open. You know what I'm saying? You all are very joyous, kind of like just very bubbly type of energy. Yeah, I'm getting like Gemini energy here. Um, yeah. Cancer energy, Pisces energy as well, right? Let's see. We got existence, right? Do you notice me? A lot of people stare at y'all because they're wondering like, do you know I exist? <laughs> or can you see me? Like... Do you notice me? Come on now, please notice me. A lot of people really 
Um, and I'm, what I'm getting is that some, like, for majority of y'all, y'all don't even notice it because y'all just, y'all just too busy living life. You know what I'm saying? Y'all don't even see it. But if y'all just, you know, pay attention a little bit more, you'll be able to see all these uh, people that's trying to offer you something. The sun is rising quick. Do you see how the sun was all the way over there and it's rising? It's literally moving in y'all reading. Uh, like I said, y'all exude, y'all radiate. You know what I'm saying? Y'all energy is very divine. Very, I like, who are y'all? I love, I know I say this a lot in arenas, but who the fuck are y'all? Okay, I need to know. I want to know, okay? Uh, leave it in the comment section below. Uh, for those who chose this group, who are y'all? Cause y'all are some very divine light type of being, right? Light type of people. Like I said, very colorful. Y'all are just very joyful. I love, I'm loving y'all energy. Um, we have an advice card, okay? And it says groove, okay? It says get into the groove of things and enjoy the present moment, okay? Uh, going back to this hummingbird, get rid of all the negativity. And that's what's, that's what's going on here in this lover's card, as you can see, okay? She is in the present moment. This is what's bringing out her divinity. A lot of you all have mastered being in the present moment. A lot of you all... Um, have mastered living in the moment. You know, YOLO. <laughs> um, nah, I don't really agree with YOLO no more. I, I like saying it though because it's, it's fun. But uh, I don't technically agree with it. You only live once. You only live once as, you know, the ego consciousness that you are. Like for me, I only live once as Damien, right? Um, but my soul lives forever. And it, you know, incarnates in different places or it could reincarnate here i know this is my last reincarnation here on earth though you know i didn't heard it in too many readings i didn't you know that i've had gotten you know what i'm saying i've watched on youtube like those are free readings on youtube and i heard it anyways um yeah you guys why did i flip it this way yeah so some advice um here is maybe to tap into all the love around you, right? There's some uh, doors that may be, um, that's, that's open right now. There is some opportunities, right? Didn't, didn't we hear new opportunities, new beginnings or something like that somewhere? I think that was the hummingbird. Yeah. Um, you all's energy is like the hermit. Uh, but some advice here is to kind of tap, kind of get social a little bit, tap into or dabble, you know, because you all dabble in a lot of different things now. Like I said, kind of dabble into this uh, energy of love that's surrounding you. There's some magic there for y'all. OK, um, let me go ahead and get um, like a, a few more charms just to end off your reading. So this is going to be kind of loud. I'm going to do it over here. Um, just one. OK, three, two, one. One, let's go. All right. Let's see what else can we get from your charms, okay? Okay. Now, as you can see, the first one I seen made sense. Heart, right? Y'all, y'all are very open-hearted. One, uh, and two, there's a lot of people that really really want to give you their heart right you have a lot of people's heart oh my god and then we have uh this tree here okay we have this tree um charm coming through a lot of people want to uh grow with you a lot of people see potential with you all a lot of people are really thinking about you know what i'm saying um they are thinking about what's the what's the word they are think like a relationship. They can see a long term relationship with you all. They can see stability uh, relationship wise with you all. Okay. Also, don't forget that one of the other pals had a um, tree for a charm too. You may want to go check out that reading. Um, and here we go. Last charm is a crown. A lot of people adore you. A lot of people love the energy that you all exude. It is very divine. It's royal. It is regal. It is poised. Okay. It is just up there okay a lot of people love your energy a lot of people want to come and communicate with you all okay and express how they feel i also get that some people just don't know how to do it though some people are a little shy some people are a little you know a little hesitant because they're like 
do she notice me? Do he notice me? You know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? Just dabble a little in the energy here, all right? But this is the reason why a lot of people stare for, uh, at you. This has been you all's reading. I hope you all enjoyed it, okay? Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you all did. And if you all are new, and turn that notification bell on, okay? Until the next, uh, next reading. Peace. Hello, pal tool. If you all chose this here, okay, tree charm, or this justice card here, then this is you all's reading. And let's go ahead and tap into it, okay? So let's start off with your little charm. Look at how it shimmers in the sunlight. Oh, girl. We love it, okay? Um, yes. Your tree charm, okay? Um, uh, 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 here we go. Something that I'm getting from this tree, okay, is that people stare at you all because they see the uh, they see how grounded you are. They see the stability that you all have. You know what I'm saying? They want to, they admire you all because of how strong you all look. Um, they see also that you all may have a lot of people um, that want to uh, talk to you. You know, or a lot of people that just want to get to know you, want to be friends with you, want to be close with you, right? Um, and they also themselves are one of those people, you know, because when I look at the tree and I think about the leaves, I think about a, a lot of different people, you know what I'm saying, that wants to connect with you, the trunk. Uh, no, the trunk? What? It, the, I don't know. I don't know what you call that part of a tree, to be honest. Um, tree trunk. Yeah. I think it's called the trunk. And then down here, it's like where the stump is at. And then under there is the roots. Um, anyways. Uh, yeah. A lot of people, a lot of people, like I said earlier, a lot of um, popular loners, a lot of people um, do want to uh, get to know you. They feel like you all are pretty cool, pretty chill, pretty laid back, as you can see here. Pretty cool, pretty chill, pretty laid back. A lot of people also stare at you because of your body. They like the way your physique looks, okay? They like the way your physique looks. You all could be very intelligent, and a lot of people could be intimidated by your intelligence as well. And the way you look, your physique. Um, I get that you all, some of y'all are some therms. <laughs> y'all like taking video. Y'all don't like wearing clothes, basically. Let's just say y'all don't like wearing clothes. I'm a therm. I know that. I like taking a lot of pictures, videos. And uh, with no shirt on, especially in the summer, I like going around with no shirt on or with a tank top on, okay? Because um, I want all the sun, okay? I want all that vitamin D, okay? Anyways, um, <laughs> anyways, right? A lot of people, a lot of people stare at you all as well because, um, Let's see. A lot of people may be staring at you all because they are intimidated. Because if you look, this man kind of looks intimidating. If you if you was to look up and see somebody looking in your general direction like this, right? You'll probably be like, okay, what the hell is he looking at? Like, you know what I'm saying? It looks like his ass is about to get get into something. And I hope it's not with me. You know what I'm saying? Uh, your energy could be, you know, a little bit... A little bit intimidating to people. You know what I'm saying? Because the physique, your intelligence, um, shit, you, you love it, your confidence as well is uh something that I'm getting as well with uh why people stare at you, you know? Um, let's see. Let's see. And this is also the justice card. You all stand for um what's right, okay? Take what resonates. You all could stand for like what's right, right? You all probably, um, st you probably, y'all don't like injustice, basically, right? Y'all do not like injustice. Did I add literally just play through? I, I, I was not paying attention to that. Anyways, um, a lot of people see, a lot of people, a lot of people have you on their radar. A lot of people see you, um, as like number one or whatnot, because as you can see, we have one singular star down here. It's not accompanied by no other stars. You are that. Uh, you all definitely are like the apple of a lot of people's eyes, which is why another reason why they stare at you. You all have a very balanced kind of physique, balanced look. You all kind of. I'm hearing like y'all. There may be some like Libra risings here. Like y'all are like very gorgeous. And have like some. 
so, uh, what is it? Like the face symmetry, right? It's very balanced. You all could have some very, 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 very uh, attractive um, physical qualities about you all, right? Um, a lot of balanced physiques here, okay? Um, whether you be slim or whether you be, you know, on the thicker side. Excuse me, because this fucking refrigerator always does this shit. And you be having me thinking fucked up, bro. I don't, I don't understand. I be having to unplug that bitch. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, but let's go ahead and get into some tarot and see what's good with you, okay? Uh, we gonna get three cards here, okay? Oh, wow, first card. Ace of Cups. Yeah, people, people like you. People like y'all. Also, a lot of people uh, stare at y'all because the Ace of Cups uh, can represent self-love as well since it's one single cup. Um, a lot of people do stare at y'all as well because they see the effort, the energy that you all put into yourself, right? Um, and the, uh, work, they see the consistency, they see the uh, consistent self-love that you all do. Look at this, Ten of Pentacles, oh, oh, baby. Yeah, some of y'all look rich. <laughs> some of y'all are rich. Uh, some of y'all have some good money. Uh, a lot of people stare at y'all because they can tell that you are about that bag. Um, you look good, smell good, living good, feeling good. Okay, uh, y'all, y'all, y'all got some, y'all got some physical. Um, yet again, y'all physical physique. So definitely, a lot of people stare at your body. A lot of people are staring at you because they like the way you look. Um, and uh, and and it's uh. The cups can sometimes mean dreams, uh, can sometimes represent dreams as well. So definitely what I'm also getting here is that a lot of people may have dreams about you guys. And as the water insinuates here, they are not just normal dreams, not just friendly, ch child-friendly dreams. Okay. I mean, wit. <laughs> but, um, yeah, damn. We have the Ace of Pentacles here. What? Hey, money. People can tell that you are about your bag. They can tell that you are about your bag. Y'all look, y'all look fucking, what's the word? Luxious? Yeah, it's giving luxious. What's the other word I'm looking for? Luxurious. That's the word, luxurious. Y'all look like y'all lead a luxurious life. Y'all got two aces here. Okay, hold on the beat though. Wait. Okay. No. Oh, hey. Hey. Belly roll it. Belly roll it. Okay, anyways. <laughs> hey, some of y'all could be belly rollers. I know I could belly roll. Uh, some of y'all may be Scorpio Risings, have very fluid movements. Um. Did I say for this pal? Was it for this pal that I say some of y'all could be dancers? I think that was I think that was the last pal. I don't know. Um, or you know, the pal that I just did, um, the group that I just read for. Yeah, with this water here, a lot of people could stare at you because y'all movements are fluid. Like y'all move very fluently, yet very uh stably. You know what I'm saying? Like, for instance, the way y'all walk, it's fluid, but it's um firm at the same time like y'all could have a very chiseled body almost like this man as well or y'all body the structure of y'all body could be pretty strong right pretty pretty strong but the way that y'all move that motherfucker is pretty fluid it makes a lot of people it, yeah it gets a lot of people daydreaming you know it gets a lot of people thinking a lot of people lost in in a trance you know what i'm saying but yeah Definitely, a lot of people want to be around y'all because y'all energy is rich. Like y'all energy is rich. I'm liking y'all energy. Um. Also, a lot of people can feel like y'all highly blessed because these aces are gifts from the universe. They are gifts from the higher realms, from the heavens. Okay, the gates of heavens. Uh, the gates of the heavens open upon you. This is how people feel. A lot of people feel like you all are very lucky, okay? Are very blessed. Let me just say blessed. A lot of people feel like y'all are extremely blessed, right? Like things literally, things literally just fall in the palm of you all's hands. A lot of people feel like y'all live a very luxurious life. And a lot of people are wondering, like I said here with the um, 
y'all look y'all look founded it y'all look stable with this um here tree you know what i'm saying a lot of people flock to y'all because they like yo what are you doing in life okay a lot of people may even look to y'all for um advice you know financial life advice yeah even like physical advice like what, what you doing like are you are doing you doing yoga like what, what you drinking what, what type of smoothie what, uh, did you just buy like what's going on here uh what you you run oh do you run do you jog like like what's going on here we need uh, to tell me something okay um a lot of people want to uh a lot of people stare at y'all uh as well because it seems like abundance is just surrounding y'all. Whether y'all see it or not, feel it or not, know it or not. It just seems like abundance surrounds y'all. A lot of people may be, a lot of people may even see that y'all are very destined for a lot of things, um, for a lot of greatness, right? If y'all not there right now, baby, it's coming. It's coming close. It's very, it's very near. Let's say that it is extremely near, okay? Let's look here and get some more um, cards, some more information, okay? Let's see, what what else, okay? What else? Why, why else do people stare at y'all? We got Archangel Metatron here, okay? Um, this Archangel, I believe, is the one that works with the Merkaba, and the Merkaba is like this type of energy. I'm gonna just read this card. It says, he... <laughs> He works, uh, Archangel uh, Metatron works with the sac with sacred geometry. Um, this Archangel also has a cube called the Merkaba that spins extremely fast, which clears out all of our energy. Okay, this Archangel uses geometry, sacred geometry, to heal and clear energy. Um, this person also, uh, I'm sorry, this um, Archangel also helps release old habits or patterns, okay, that are working but are on repeat. So, you know what I'm saying? Energy that's, you know, stagnant. Energy that's become stagnant, right? Damn, do you, then you have another Archangel, Archangel Ariel. You can look up that Archangel as well. Um, Yeah, you have Archangel. So, a lot of people probably stare at you all as well because they actually admire you and look up to you. Because, you know, you kind of got it going on here. Um, Whether you know it. Or not feel it or not see it or not you got it going on okay and a lot of people this is the reason why they stare at you because they like yo if I could just have a life like theirs goddamn um things would be a lot different right a lot of people also stare at you because they wanna they want to talk to you about this shit they're like yo literally what are you doing right help me help me nigga <laughs> okay um, they, they, with this Archangel, uh, Metatron coming through, um, they can, a lot of people also see, uh, look at you, uh, stare at you because you all probably had went through a massive, like, transformation, right? Massive transformation. And they see a completely new person. They're like, who the fuck is this? Who the fuck? <laughs> who the fuck? fuck is this nah nah man this is not this is not this is not this is not uh the same person this is not the sean this is not the sean i don't know who the hell this is this is not the sean um i don't know why that name just came up um the energy that you all uh exude right come on now the energy that you all exude is like the cat why is the camera tweaking what the hell is that all that the cat though I love cats. I love cats. Um, I can already tell you this is very poised. Very, I almost just said, well, yeah, God-like energy because in um, ancient Kemet, in ancient Kemet or you know ancient Egypt, they worship cats. So God-like energy. Even the way he's standing here, he he kind of you know uh, the song that just came up to me is feel like God. Mm, mm. You know that song about damn, forgot that man name. Shit. I'm forgetting everybody's name. Shit, I don't be really into celebrities' lives like that. But anyways, the cat is a fire elemental spirit animal that is all about intuition, understanding things, elegance. Ooh, ooh, we elegance. That's the word I was looking for with this ten of pentacles. Elegant. 
whether you're male or female, elegance, elegance is not, um, it's not gender bound. Okay. Elegance is for everybody. <laughs> Anybody can get the elegance. Anybody can embody the energy of elegance and poise, right? Oh, the cat also represent poise, right? Being poised. Self-love. Didn't we say that? Yep. Self-love. Well, I just love how these cards are confirming things that's coming through. That's letting me know I am on point. Anyways, um, self-love, wisdom, grace, poise, insight, and awareness, okay? The wisdom token, yeah, hell yeah. Look at how aware this man look. He like, uh, you want to try it? <laughs> you want to try it? I see you, you piece of shit. What you trying to creep up on me for? What you creeping for? <laughs> all right, all right, Devin. I digress. Bring it back, Damien, bring it back. Um, if you hear me call myself two different names... Oh, this is kind of deep. That's because, oh man, that's kind of deep. Both of those are my names, right? Both of those are my names. Um, Devin is my birth name, but Damien is my actual name. If that makes sense. Okay, we are good into it later. But um, the wisdom token unto you all from uh, the cat spirit animal, okay? The, the spirit of the cat is to believe in the power that is illusion, okay? Don't fall victim to false beliefs. Don't uh, be a fool to do um, a fool due to ignorance and um, achieve complete understanding from your own wisdom. Okay, so this is very interesting that this message is coming through. Like I said, intelligence is intimidating. A lot of people, there are some people that may, I can, okay, here we go. You have haters. You definitely have haters because of the abundance around you. You definitely have people that just don't understand why you have so much. Why so much is getting ready to come into your life? Why so much is in your life? Why so much is coming into your life, right? Why you have so much, right? Why you are destined for so much. Um, and a lot of people don't like it. A lot of people um, do not like it. Uh, you have those who wants to get in that energy that you're in. And then you have those over here, you know what I'm saying, who's jealous of the energy that you're in, right? And who look down, or who don't really look down, they can't look down upon you. Like, come on now, your ass have the high ground. Do you see him standing on that shit? Like, he has the high ground, obviously. Okay, um, y'all have the high ground, obviously. <laughs> Um, anyways, you know what I'm saying? And y'all are favored by God. Like, you all are favored. Do you see that? You have two aces that came out. What? What? Anyways, like I was saying, y'all have, um, some haters. Some true fans, right? Y'all have some true fans. Um, them haters are fans. I call them fans, right? They, that's, that's the other name is fans. Um, yeah, y'all have some fans. Y'all have some fans that don't like what y'all doing. Mm -mm. They trying to fan out the fire. Excuse me, bitch, get the fuck on. Y'all can move around. Move on, move on. Okay, y'all as with this cat spirit animal coming out, um, a lot of people, uh, some people stare at you because they plotting, um, but they can't see a way. They're looking for the chink in the armor, but they can't find it. God damn it. Y'all are some raw, powerful son bitches. Who are y'all? Let me know. Uh, we have the word quality. Come on now. Ten of pentacles. Ace of pentacles. Y'all are about quality. A lot of people stare at y'all because y'all have quality things. Y'all do quality things. And y'all are around quality beings. Like, y'all do not surround y'allself. Do you see this shit here? Y'all surround, y'all have quality things, doing quality things, and uh, surrounding yourself around quality beings. Look, all these people up in this, all these people up in this card have luxurious clothes on. Silk from the finest. I don't know where silk come from. Damn, that's, that's deep. But yeah, <laughs> silk from the finest wherever they come from, okay? Y'all have the finest fucking mansion. You have the dogs, okay? Y'all have the money. Y'all have the fat. Like, come on now, y'all. Y'all looking good. Y'all is looking good, okay? Quality. Let's get it. <laughs> Hello? Quality. Y'all ass. Wow, that was quick as hell. Did y'all see how that flew out? Shit literally handed to you. See? You hold your hand out. It just appeared. A lot of people is um stare at you because they trying to figure out how are you manifesting? What are you doing? What rituals are you doing, bitch? <laughs> I want to know now. I want to know, genuinely. 
Look, transformation. Didn't I say her? Yo, I am on point today. Look, I'm going to give myself. I have to do it. I have to do it. I had to clap. I had to clap it up for my fucking self, yo. I am on point. Transformation, yo. P- y'all, I'm getting that y'all ass probably have not been like that. Yeah, the tree. But people have seen you grow. A lot of people seen you grow from when you was down here, right? When you was down here, they seen you grow and sprout and flourish and prosper and blossom. Look at these flowers. Uh, come on, babes. You see all this shit down here? Look at all that magic. All of these, the blossom. Like, come on now. Come on. People didn't really see you sprout. People didn't see the transformation. They like, yo, who is this? Like I said, this is not Deshaun. Okay, this is not Deshaun. This is not. This is not Damon. This is da- uh, this is not Devin. This ain't Devin. This is Damien. <laughs> what the fuck? This is not Devin. This is Damien. Hell no. Anyways, uh, we got triple love card here. Okay. Uh, it says, oh, purpose field. Okay. Let's read. It says, so many admire you. Didn't I say that? So many admire you because they can see that you're a purpose field. That you're that you have so much potential. I am on point today, bro. Didn't we say that a lot of people see that you're destined for so much, bro? Look, all right. I'm going to end off the reading here. I have went through all the cards. Uh, I'm sorry to... Oh, no, 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 no. I almost forgot about these charms, baby. Look, there's more. <laughs> there's more. Look, and that's another reason why... Uh, so many people stare at you because it just seems like your abundance never fucking in. It just seems like you're just accumulating so much. Just so much. So fucking much. We're going to get some charms. Uh, sound warning, okay, for people who have fucking headphones in. I'm going to do it over here. Three, two, one. Let's go. What's wrong with my finger? Oh, I scratched it a little bit. I'm like, what the hell is that on my knuckle? What the fuck? Anyways, let's go. Let's see. Spirit, what? What can we get um, in the charms for my group twos here? Okay, y'all got a, a bit a bit much here. Okay. Oh, yo! We is on point today! Look at this charm. It says, good luck. Horse, this is the horseshoe. Good luck. Come on now, focus, bitch. Good luck. Yo, what the... I said that shit earlier. People feel like your ass is just blessed. Come on now, blessed. Hey, I want some of y'all energy. Um, y'all leave it in the comment section below. Okay, um, here we go. We have damn, this is a nice charm. I like this. Um, hang on, this is a nice charm. Anyways, I'm gonna have to put this shit back in the bag. Come on. Wait, did y'all just see me? I don't want y'all to see me yet. <laughs> Even though if y'all you know follow me on social media, y'all have seen me. I don't want y'all to see me yet on this channel. I'm going to keep this bag because this is going to have to go back in the bag. It's kept it looking fresh as fuck. Um, yeah, we have this heart charm with these little rhy- 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 well, rhinestones. I don't know. I don't think these are. Obviously, these are not real diamonds. Um, but yeah, with these little sparklies in here. And we got the word rescued. Okay. I don't quite understand what that one is about. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of people probably stare at you as well because they they see, like, yeah, going back to transformation, they see how you've transformed your life. They see how this good luck, I, I remember saying that earlier, like, people see you as lucky, how this good luck just swooped in out of no fucking where um, and just started changing your whole entire life. That's what I'm really getting with this, right? Some of y'all could have been, you know what I'm saying, in the trenches, before in your past, but things have really changed, right? And then look here, we got this charm here. We got the Unk with uh, the Eye of Ra or the Eye of Horus, you know, whichever one you would like. I believe the Eye of Ra, possibly, yeah. We got another shiny, a little shiny, shiny uh, in the um, in the eye here, right? Um, what I'm getting with this is that yet again, divine energy, yo. Y'all have divine energy. A lot of people just see life in you. They see a whole bunch of life. You know what I'm saying? Trees give life. You know what I'm saying? Because they they give off that oxygen, baby. And they look, silver spoon. 
what the fuck? How was I holding this the whole fucking time? <laughs> How was I holding this the whole fucking time? And didn't even notice it was a silver spoon. Definitely, a lot of people kind of feel like y'all have a silver spoon. Now, I, 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 I hear the people in the back that, you know, may not resonate with this energy or where they, you know, that's not resonating with this energy right now. Give it some time. Remember this reading. Remember this motherfucking reading. If y'all don't see none of this yet, remember this motherfucking reading. It, you heard it here first, folks. People in the back that that's doubting, that don't see all this yet, baby. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Just be a little bit more patient. Wait a little bit longer. Baby, this shit is right around the corner. That's all I can say. That's all I uh have to say on it. Silver spoon, baby. People gonna think that y'all ass was born. Uh, luxurious. They don't know. They don't know your beginnings, though. You may not come from humble beginnings, but the rest of your story is up to you. Okay. And obviously, y'all have been taken. Y'all took the wheel. Y'all have been um taking control of y'all life. Y'all like you look. Eh. Let's. It's time to boss up. Okay. But with that being said, that is all that we have here for your reading. I hope you all enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed reading and channeling this energy. Like, oh my god. Um, I would love to give you all a handshake. Uh, give me some of that energy. Yes. <laughs> um, yeah, but love, light, peace, power, and abundance to you all. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if, um, you all are new. Don't forget to subscribe and, um, turn that notification bell on as well, all right? With that being said, deuces. Hello, my last group, pal threes. Group threes. I'm sorry, not pals, because there's not a pal of shit up here. Um, group threes, if you all have chosen this rose charm, okay, or this chariot card here, this is your reading. Let's dive into it now real quick. Let's just say this. Let, I know you all noticed that the, 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 the sun, <laughs> the sun, is moving very fucking quickly. Look at the time right now on the goddamn video. Okay, it hasn't been that long. What time is it right now? It's 10, it's 1051. It hasn't been this long. The sun in the very beginning of the fucking video was all the way over there at the edge. Look at how this motherfucker just moved here. I feel like this group is very chosen because the sun is right dead smack in the middle of the damn table. This is where the majority of the reading is gonna be at. I feel like y'all are very chosen. Um, we just gonna get that out the way. This, oh yeah, that could be a main reason why a lot of people stare at you as well. They just feel like your ass is chosen for something great. Chosen for something beautiful. You know what I'm saying? They just feel like y'all ass got that it factor. And y'all got, Y'all got that energy that is just unique. Look at the rose. I feel like roses represents uniqueness, okay? Love as well, but uniqueness, right? Uniqueness. A lot of people stare at you because you are unique. You are not afraid to express yourself. You're not afraid to express yourself, right? To open up and um, be you. We have the chariot card here, right? Traditionally, the chariot represents... Um, you know what I'm saying? Like, basically, management. Like, like, okay. Basically, representing moving passionately and fast towards your desires, towards your goals. All those twits, uh, all those sorts of things, right? Um, and all of that. A lot of people can uh, stare at you because they see the determination. They see your will will not be. Yeah, ooh, they see that your will is absolute. Damn! Bitch! Hold on, I had to lean back in the chair, okay? Look, now let's jump back into it, hop back into it, bro. Yo, y'all! Who the f- Y'all! Okay, all right, we're not even gonna do this shit. Y'all are divine. Here we go again with the ring around the head. Uh, come on now. Come on now. Uh, usually a lot of deities or like gods in like anime or whatever have this ring around their head. You know what I'm saying? It represents the divinity, right? A lot of people can uh, stare at you because they know that y'all as they you have an energy that is out of this world. It's very divine. People stare at y'all because also because of y'all beauty, right? With this rose right here. 
A lot of people stare at y'all because of y'all beauty. A lot of people feel, like I said, that it factor, we got the key here. A lot of people feel and stare at y'all because they feel like y'all ass are magical. They feel like y'all ass got, y'all ass got access. Okay, with the key, y'all ass got access to some gifts, to some shit that a lot of people here are not, they don't have access to. A lot of people stare at you because they're like, yo, this person, they got some shit going on. Okay, they, they own, like they got some shit going on. A lot of people don't know what it is. And that's another thing. Uh, as you can see, it's nighttime in the back, right? A lot of people, a lot of people cannot figure you out. They can't put their finger on what it is about you that is so attractive, so unique, so just alluring, so seductive. I'm also getting that too. Here, eyes again. Look at his eyes, right? Oh, y'all got some killer eyes. Oh, y'all got them cat eyes. Y'all got them eyes that pierce, baby. I'm right with y'all. Um, I got that shit. I definitely do. A lot of people stare at you because they like looking into your eyes, right? A lot of people stare at you because they want to start a conversation. A lot of people stare at you because they see the uniqueness. They can see. They can see it. Like, they can see it. A lot of people stare at you as well because you're mysterious. This man, uh, Aaron's dad, I forgot his name. I'm forgetting names left and right. Like, what's going on? Um, I forgot his name. But Aaron's dad in this show, Attack on Titan... He was a very mysterious man. Like, um, what are you doing in the cellar down there? What's going on? What? 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 And then how he disappeared in the damn, like, very mysterious. Like, you all have mysterious energy. Y'all have the energy of someone who is very magical. Y'all, y'all, I'm going to say it. Some of y'all could be like witches or wizards, you know what I'm saying? Have like very magical energy. Like y'all, y'all probably follow the moon. Um, what is that called? The moon cycles. Um, you know what I'm saying? Y'all probably follow the moon cycle, pay attention to it. Y'all probably manifest according to the moon and stuff. I know I do. Um, and that's kind of easy a little bit. Well, not easy. I'm not going to say that, but um, definitely that is for um that definitely will resonate with a lot of women because you know what i'm saying y'all have y'all menstrual cycle or whatnot you know what i'm saying so y'all automatically is kind of like following the um cycle whether you knew that the cycle that your menstrual cycle you know what i'm saying your period or whatnot um was connected to the moon or not um yeah yeah, y'all follow the moon, uh, the, the, the movement of the moon, the cycles of the moon. Okay, so let's get into some tarot. Let's get into some tarot. Um, because I'll be just on this card all damn day. Um, yeah, y'all are very mysterious. Y'all have this unique it factor, bro. I see all three cards this one and then this one right here. Look at that. Wow, shit. Yeah. Okay, so the first card. Wow. Jesus, Queen of Pentacles. Look at how divine her ass look. The sun is kind of fucking up. Um, okay, a little bit. Here we go. Look at how divine she look. Look at all this abundance, all this vegetation, all this fruit, all this shit that's going on around her. And then something I noticed the other day. I didn't notice this person, this being in the background playing a flute and all this magic going on. I just noticed that when I was doing a reading for myself. I'm like, whoa. There's somebody in the back. There is somebody back there. I'm like, all this shit going on. Y'all got a lot of shit going on. Y'all are very magical. Y'all manifest. Y'all y'all are manifestors. Y'all are kind of effortlessly manifestors. Also, why is this card kind of bending? What the hell is going on? Uh, what? Okay. There we go. I, I, I seen it here, and then I just seen it on the camera, too. I'm like, what the hell? motherfucker look like it is bending up i don't know why anyways y'all y'all are like master manifestors look we got that card mastery um and flow it's effortless okay y'all do this shit <laughs> y'all do this shit some of y'all could be capricorns as well with the uh little goat up here mm -hmm. uh yeah and also y'all may want to look up the spirit animal of a rabbit yeah yes sir okay 
y'all, 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 y'all definitely um are some manifestors. Whether y'all are aware of y'all manifesting or not, y'all definitely manifest. Let's see, we got the seven of wands here as well. And then we have lastly the ten of swords. Okay, this beat is kind of nice. Um, yeah, let me move this up a little bit. Okay. Yeah. So let me look at this. Definitely you all. Okay. Yeah. A lot of people feel like y'all are just unique. Like a lot of people may feel like y'all, y'all got this energy that is out of this world. Like something that just stood out to me. I never really seen it, but I seen it because the sun is exposing it. These stars up here. I never seen that shit. I never paid attention to it. And then like this little this little arc right here. I don't know if that's like a I don't know. I never paid attention to the sky up there. I mean, I paid attention to the sky right here because the sun. You know what I'm saying? I can see the sun. I can see shit here, but I never really paid attention to up there because it, it's dark. You know what I'm saying? I never really seen that. Never really paid attention to it. Wow. Um yeah, a lot of people stare at you as well because they feel like they feel like okay something that just this is very interesting something that came up um oh okay we got two different things okay you see how this per you see how this character here is staring right he kind of got like this mean mug look on his face he's like bitch get the fuck away from me you 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 peasant <laughs> what the fuck get the hell away from me um a lot of people stare at you because um, some people stare at you as well uh, because they envy you, one, and because they are judging you. You know, look, we're going to keep it a buck. We're going to keep it a hundred on here. Some people are judging you. With all these swords, this represents thoughts uh, or words said. A lot of people are judging you. They're judging you because of your uniqueness. They're judging you because of how you live your life, how you express yourself, Right. And they also mad because your ass is manifesting. Look at how fat this fucking pentacle is. Are you serious, bitch? Like, come on now. People, people, they judging and they mad and they hate. And oh, yeah, with the seven of wands here. People envy you. They want what you got. They want to steal it, but they cannot even touch you. Your ass is on a whole different level, as you can see here. Like I pointed out in a different reading, in the last reading, right? Oh, well, in the last video. Um, that I did. You can't see nobody down here, but you can see you and you can see that you got the higher ground. A lot of people is not on your level. They're not on your level and they don't, they can't, they don't, they can't take you. They don't, they can't take you. They don't know how to handle you. Simple as that. Okay. And a lot of people be judging. And, um, also the second thing I was getting from this car here, um, is Yet again, that mean mug face, right? Y'all got some killer fucking, if looks can kill, baby, definitely yours will. <laughs> yours will. Look at how this man dead. He dead as hell. There is no coming back. Look, this man is dead as hell. Okay, red usually means power in, um, in the goddamn tarot. Not for this motherfucker. He's wearing a red robe. This man dead as hell. He ain't got no power. No power left. Um, that's how much power that you all have, though. Y'all have the power to strip people of their power just by a look. Yo, y'all, who are y'all? I didn't ask every last pal that. I love asking that question. Who are y'all? Let's get into the tarot. Uh, some, some of these cards here so I can figure out. I want more. Y'all ass are, um, y'all, excuse me. If looks could kill, look at her face. Look at her. Come on, please give it to me. Give me clear vision. There we go. Look at her face. She's like, bitch, I don't give a fuck about what you're talking about. I don't give a damn about who you think you are. I, I can give a... I, I, I have no shits to give about what the fuck you're saying. Bitch, please move the hell on. If looks could kill, yours definitely can, okay? That's another reason why people stare at you because they're like, yo, why... Why does person always look like they ready to... They Like they ready for it. Why this person look like they ready all the time? <laughs> this person is on guard. <laughs> like on guard. 
this person is on guard uh, all the time. Like, how this person always look like they ready? They are aware. Like, y'all got a keen sense of awareness as well, okay? Let's see. Come on, y'all. Come with it, y'all. Yeah, that's two cards. You tried it, spirit. <laughs> Let me get one card. And we have an Archangel, Archangel Jeremy. We got Scorpio energy up here. Damn, what was I about to set that shit at? I don't know. <laughs> and then we got the at the top of the deck, the law of inspired action, okay? The sun is casting shadows. I am so sorry for that. <laughs> oh, yeah. I am so sorry about that, but yeah. Anyway, yes, man. <sighs> Scorpio. Scorpio energy. Scorpios. Scorpios. Scorpios have that energy um, that a lot of people, all astrologers, always say something about Scorpio people is their eyes. They, Their eyes kill, bro. They eyes, they have the power within their eyes, bro. That stare, yo, I'm a Scorpio rising, so that's how I know that shit is intense. A lot of people usually can't look at me when I'm talking to them. You know what I'm saying? They looking away at stuff. Sometimes I get a little... Sometimes I'd be irritated because I'm like, damn, I love eye contact, but a lot of people can't handle my eye contact, the power that lies behind it, right? Like, come on, y'all ass is a beast with y'all eyes. Y'all said a million words said just through a look, bro. We, I, we got that shit. Archangel Jeremy, uh, let's read about this Archangel. It says, Archangel Jeremy is quiet. This Archangel is quiet in the way that... Um, it communicates, okay? This archangel um, mainly communicates through symbols, mental movies, and through visions and uh, dreams, okay? This angel, archangel, helps developing clairvoyance. Look, sight, sight, sight. Clairvoyance is being able to see fucking things. Ooh, a lot of people also stare at you because they, they... Oh, that's interesting. That's quite interesting. A lot of people stare at you because they feel like you can look. The sun is moving quick as hell. What the fuck? The sun is moving quick as shit. Yo, that shit's raw as fuck. I'm gonna go take a walk after this. Hell yeah. Why not? Enjoy the sun, bitch. What the fuck? Anyways, um, I might go shoot some hoops. Anyways, um, yes, clairvoyance, the looks. Y'all, a lot of people stare at y'all because they feel like y'all can see straight through them. However, right? Usually when people say that, people, you know, a lot of people don't want to look at you. Like for me, you know what I'm saying? I definitely be seeing straight through people bullshit. I be seeing straight through the acts and a lot of people can feel that I can see straight through that shit and they just stop. They just stop. They stop doing that shit. They're like, you know what? It's not even worth it. Let me just stop. They stop. I literally see them break down and they stop. Um, but for some reason, I'm, see, I'm hearing that that is, for some people, like, that is, um, uh, people get hooked on it. They kind of get addicted to it. It, it it's kind of, it, it kind of turns them on. I don't know what the hell is going on here. Cause we do have the wands here. You know what I mean? Like you see all these wands sticking up in this motherfucker up here. Like, oh my God, that's too much. They, they swing and they. They got the wine up and they're like, get that shit away from me. Get that shit away from me. Like, y'all kind of, y'all kind of get people riled up. You know what I'm saying? If you know, you know. Um, through y'all eyes. That's why a lot of people stare at y'all. Like, a lot of people look at y'all and then look, y'all are definitely aesthetically pleasing. Like, we, let's just get this out the way. Y'all are attractive, okay? Y'all body, the way y'all dress, magnificent. But, um, not but, however, I don't know if y'all just seen that spray of spit, that shower of saliva that just protruded right here in this area. Hopefully y'all didn't, but if y'all did, I am sorry. That shit is embarrassing. <laughs> That's embarrassing. Anyways, um, yeah, also what I'm also getting is that a lot of people stare at y'all because they want to, they want to communicate with y'all. But they do not know how to. And it's killing them in on the inside. It's killing them mentally because they're like, God damn. Why can't I just fix myself to say something to this person? Also, another reason why uh, another reason why people stare at you is that, you know, the, them haters, them people that judge you and shit, they want to say some shit to you. But they know good and goddamn well that they will get, they will end up looking just like this motherfucker right here. They, they just feel, they just feel 
those thousand words said within the looks that you give people, a lot of people may try y'all. A lot of people try y'all. But um, you know what I'm saying? You listen. Like I said, effortless type of manifestation, right? Y'all as y'all as know how to uh ward off negative energy like it ain't nothing. These people the the hatred, the low vibrational energy, right? That people be sending your way, it it it, it, it rolls right off your uh, it, it it doesn't phase you. It's like water right off a back's uh, a, a a dust back. That shit does not phase y'all. It does not phase y'all at all. But Archangel Jeremiel, let's get back to it. Archangel Jeremiel um helps with developing clairvoyance, right? So y'all intuition is definitely on point, okay? A lot of people look at y'all because they like, damn, I can't, I can't, I can't get over on this motherfucker for shit. Um, Jer Archangel Jeremiel helps one see the bigger picture in their life as well, okay? Um, yes. Okay, so let's go ahead and get some some more cards. So let's get some more cards, okay? Let's see what else. What else is good? Um, boom. Okay, water. Some of y'all may be some water signs. Also, a lot of people may stare at y'all because of y'all skin. Y'all may drink a lot of water. Y'all may drink a lot of water as well. Um, a lot of people feel like y'all energy is very fluid, right? Um, very fluid. They feel like the words like y'all clap back city uh clap back city okay i gotta say it like they feel like they a lot of people stare at you because they they see how fluid you are with your with your wit with your communication skills right they see how fluid uh you are also your energy is very laid back chill cool calm collected unbothered like a lot of people a lot of and a lot of people stare at you because they can see um the the sweet the sweetness of you all right the very fluid kind of um kind of uh what i get is like the energy that i get is that kind of like scorpion energy right the energy of a scorpion or even a crab you know what i'm saying um or even a lion whatever type of animal that's usually minding its business Right and not bothering nobody until it bothers until um somebody bothers them. Now they're going full force at your ass. Right now they're attacking that ass. Just like water, it could be nice and calm, but when you tap the water, ripples. Right, still water. If you tap a pond, uh, 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 um, uh, if you put water in a bowl and you tap it, right. The water is still, first of all, when you tap it, the ripples create and then it bounces off the, the, the barrier and comes back and it's just, you know, continuing to do that until it steals itself out. Um, same thing here. A lot of people stare at you because they, they know, they know that y'all got that heat. Even though this is water, y'all got that heat. Y'all, <laughs> y'all, what if somebody, if somebody, anybody messes with you, if anybody, you know, messes with the piece of the water you know what i'm saying if anybody messes with the still waters right if anybody try to mess with you um this sun is moving it was right here by the neck now it's by his key that shit is moving fast that shit raw as fuck um i'm literally like seeing the shit like are y'all seeing this with me on the camera anyways um a lot of people know that um, you are just, un you cannot be fucked with, okay? Untouchable, just untouchable. And you can do all the damage to them. They, it's like, it's like your HP is doubled plus buffs, right? Plus buffs, plus enhancements, like plus armor. Like what the fuck? These people are like booty ball naked and have half the goddamn armor that you have. Um, a lot of people stare at you because they want to say something to you. Now, whether, it, whether it's good or bad, they want to say something to you, but they as get torn to shreds just by your look, right? Um, your look, your energy is intense. It's mysterious, it's intense. And um, a lot of people just do not know how to approach you. For real. We got uh, another 
wow, water element, right? Water, 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 water. Y'all could be a water sign. Um, or just be very fluid in the way that y'all move, very in tune, very psychic, very um, intuitive, right? We got ocean, water element, ocean. Oh, I'm gonna put it up here. <laughs> yeah, water element, uh, ocean here, okay? Definitely wet. Um, another reason why a lot of people stare at you all is because they have an a, a sea of emotions for you, a ocean of emotions for you. Like a lot of people, a lot of people, you know, for you and towards you, for you, you know, and towards you. All right. Whether they are good or bad, high vibrational emotions or low vibrational emotions, they got some words. Okay. They got emotions that they want to express. However, you know what I'm saying? They don't know how to clearly uh, express that. Y'all energy is very intense. I keep saying that. I like feel it right now. It's like making the hairs on the back of my head stand up. <laughs> okay. It, 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 it's very intense. Oh, we got zebra energy. What did I say about being unique, bro? Zebra energy is all about uniqueness, isn't it? To me, it is about uniqueness. It's about uniqueness. Now, we got the number 12 here as well, which is connected to um the hangman and when you reduce 12 it connects you to um the empress right because of the number three um so yeah let's read about the zebra this is the type of energy that you all exude right we got fire the zebra is a fire elemental spirit animal that is all about beauty power limitless energy uniqueness there it is individuality inner self appreciation, strength, confidence, determination, and drive, okay? Yeah, we said that earlier. Whoa, that's raw as fuck. Okay, anyways, um, the wisdom token from the zebra to you all today is to be quick on your feet and have a vision of what you want, okay? What you desire to happen with your life, okay? Don't be afraid to be yourself. Uniqueness, let's go. Don't be afraid to be yourself. Strive. Uh, excuse me, strive to make your um, mark on the world. Appreciate your challenges, right? And you definitely have challenges, right? Or at least challengers or people who want to challenge you. But they, anyways, y'all, it's not even worth talking about. They ass is irrelevant. <laughs> okay. Um. Wow. It's, that's, I'm on point today, bro. I swear. It's this one. Um, last card. A deep questions card. Let's get into it. Limitations. And then, didn't, didn't, didn't it say limitless? Yes, limitless energy. The zebra is about limitlessness. Uh and then we have limitations here. A deep question. See, this is some deep work right here. This is about to be some shadow work right here. It says, How are you limiting yourself? How are you allowing limitations to crush your inner being? Are you who you really meant to be right now? Yo. Hey, I am sorry that you just heard that. You know, I'm in an apartment, so I'm sorry y'all just heard that man just coughing like that. See, this is why I don't go outside now. Because I be hearing that shit, and I'm like, mm -mm, I'm not taking a walk today. I thought I was not doing it. All this nastiness outside. What the fuck? <laughs> Any fucking ways, okay? Limitations, okay? A lot of people want to put, like, some type of they, they, they want to try to contain you. Like we said earlier, they cannot tame you. They don't know how to handle you. Your uniqueness is too bright. It's shining very bright. And um, it's outshining a lot of people around you, which is making them see you as a threat. They see you as competition, um, which is why they are come, you know, they're trying to come after you. But your ass is on a whole different level. They can't even reach you. You know what I'm saying? They can't reach you, but you can still deal damage. You have the higher ground, like we said earlier, bro. That shit rock. Anyways, <clears throat> let's go ahead and end off the reading with some charms. This shit gonna be loud, so I'm gonna do it over here, and I'm gonna give you a three-second warning. Three, two, and motherfucking one. Let's get it. Okay, let's see, spirit. What charms? Oh, we got a charm that fell fucking out. Charms usually don't fall out. Okay, let's see. All right. Take these down, y'all. I got quite uh, um, the number of charms. Now, the one that fell out is this um, bow right here. Okay, this bow right here. What I'm getting is 
that y'all, uh, y'all, y'all, y'all are pretty, pretty intelligent. Also, y'all as are very, um, what is that? I'm kind of getting playful energy for some reason. This bow right here or ribbon or whatever you want to call it. It's kind of giving me play for energy. It's kind of reminding me of like anime or whatever, like the girls, like when they in school, you know how they have uniforms and the boys have like ties or whatever. And the girls have them like bows that kind of look like this, um, where, you know, a tie would go, or they usually have this in their hair or something to hold the hair up. I'm getting like kind of playful energy, kind of playful, seductive type of energy. A lot of people stare at you also because you are pretty seductive. You're natural energy, right? Because you express your energy. You're very unique. Your natural energy is kind of seductive. Going back to that Scorpio energy. Y'all some bad motherfuckers. We got the Christmas tree here. Come on now. Christmas tree with the star at the top. This is a pretty ugly looking star, <laughs> but still you get the point. Okay. Um, Christmas tree with the star. I'm hearing because the Christmas, these, you know, trees, last during the cold winters i'm getting that y'all know how to be cold <laughs> y'all know when to turn that shit on i'm feeling i'm getting that for the most part y'all are very warm nice people you know what i'm saying especially with the sun like being in majority of y'all reading y'all are very warm and nice people however as you can see over here as you can see over here it and as you can see how fast that this shadow came on this table and how fast the sun is moving out the way like Literally, it's moving quick as fuck, bro. Um, it was at the key the last time I brought it up. Now it's down here. That shit raw as fuck. It's moving quick as hell. Um, like I was saying, as you see the shadow approaching and the sun exiting quick as hell, um, a lot of people feel like you're just ready. You're ready for it. Because y'all done went through some shit already. You know what I'm saying? In y'all life. Y'all done went through some shit that was fucking with y'all mentally. Um, and now that y'all then, you know, kind of passed the test with those teens and got over it, y'all like, bitch, I'm ready for any fucking thing. You can try me if you want to. You will get slayed. Okay? Anyways. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah. You did survive through some, uh, some very cold times, tough times with this tree here. Um, and you have emerged victorious and now are shining bright because of it with the star on top of this tree we got the word love here a lot of people stare at you uh whether you know it or not because majority of the people who stare at you hold on we blurry okay majority of the people stare at you because they they love you even the haters you know what i'm saying the fans the haters yeah they 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 love you you know hate is just a perverted version of love <laughs> Your haters are just um, people who love you, but that have a very twisted, fucked up, perverted way of expressing that shit to you. You know what I'm saying? They're allowing other things like jealousy and shit to, you know, lead the way, you know, when it comes down to expressing their love for you. So, you know, just don't mind them. Love your haters. Okay. They are, you know, appreciate them. Um, then we have the anchor here. Ooh. Ooh. A lot of people do feel like you're grounded. A lot of people stare at you because they see that you're grounded. And mm, something that just came up is that whenever you are, wherever you are, whatever you are, what? Wherever you are, right? Um, when you're there, you're there. Like, you know how to be in the present moment. You know what I'm saying? And also... You all, what I'm getting is, is that if you claim something, you claim that shit. If you say this is mine, or if you say I'm going to have that, you're going to get that. Like I said, effortlessly manifesting, right? Effortless manifestors, all right? Um, and because you all are true to yourself and you um, are not moving on that, a lot of people stare at you because they can see that you all are unfucking shakable. They're like, this motherfucker can't be moved. God damn. Okay, what the fuck? And usually, where do they? Where do people put anchors? Where do people put anchors? In water. What type of water? Usually, that salt water in the ocean. I don't know what I'm talking about, right? Usually, people that's you know traveling through sea. Um, then we got a puzzle piece here. A lot of people stare at you because they are puzzled. You leave people puzzled. You leave. You leave people thinking. Like I said, 
People just don't know how to approach you. They can't tame you. They, didn't, they can't take you. They don't know, don't know how to approach you. Don't even know how to properly fucking try to attempt to uh, show hate on your ass. And lastly, we got, what does this shit say? Hockey mom? <laughs> this is so random. Hockey mom. Okay, you got a hockey mom here. Um, charm here. Uh, some of y'all may like hockey. Okay, some of y'all moms may like hockey. Uh, you may have played f floor hockey when you was young and your mom was a huge supporter of you. Or maybe she played floor hockey when she was young or something. I don't know. Um, what I'm getting it with this is that um, when you shoot your shot with anything, when it comes down to anything, and I mean anything, like I said earlier, because you know hockey people, they smack the puck with the little hockey stick and shit and they be smacking that bitch hard as hell. Whenever you shoot your shot, right? Whenever you shoot your shot, it is on point, baby. It is on point, and it is, and it is moving at speeds that that can fucking kill. Okay, it is moving at speeds that can motherfucking kill. Um, yeah, it's something else I'm getting with this hockey mom. I don't know what the hell. What what what, what what's what's it giving, spirit? What's it giving? There's something else here. What is it giving? Okay. Yeah, your words hit hard. Okay, your words hit hard. Your words hit hard as fuck. Okay. They almost like darts <laughs> in a way. Whenever you are in that energy, in that mode of, yeah, bitch, I'm about to annihilate your life with just a look. If they get you past the look, you know it's over with. They know it's over with. They know it's over with, and everybody else around knows it's over with. Because if you have to speak, oh, baby, you're not holding back shit. You're expressing all of it. And you're, I, I'm starting to get Sagittarian vibes now. Aquarian vibes, yep, yep. Leo vibes, yep. Capricorn and Virgo vibes, yes. Y'all motherfuckers, y'all two, them two earth signs I just mentioned, Virgo and Capricorn, y'all are some shady some bitches. I swear to God, y'all can be shady. I like it though. I like it. I like it. I like it. Okay. Anyways, um, that's all that I have right here for you all's reading. I hope you all enjoyed this as much as I enjoyed doing this and uh, reading for you all. It was amazing. Um, if you all feel like you enjoyed this, please express it by liking, commenting, sharing the video, and subscribing if you are new. And do not forget, uh, uh, forget to turn the notification bell on as well. With that being said, love, light, peace, power, and abundance to you all. I say, amen, and period. We out this bitch.